The NAACP's Corpus Christi Chapters Freedom Fund Gala is set for January 15th here, the American Bank Center from 630 until 9 p.m. But on that very same night, not too far away, here at the Solomon Ortiz Center, the Their Day Foundation will hold the Martin Luther King Jr. Annual Community Funds Banquet from 7 to 9 p.m. Two very similar organizations holding very similar events on the same day at basically the same time. Jeremy Coleman, the local NAACP president, says his organization has held their gala the Saturday before the Martin Luther King Day March downtown every year for the past 28 years. Coleman won his seat over former President Terry Mills back in March in what Mills called a fraud election. Coleman's now accusing Mills of trying to discredit the NAACP gala by holding the banquet for the Their Day Foundation, which Mills founded several years ago, at the same time. Mills directed me to his group's spokesperson today who told me they didn't intentionally schedule their banquet to overlap with the gala. That was after Coleman held a news conference this afternoon where he said, in part, that buying a ticket to Mills' banquet does not support the NAACP. The NAACP, Corpus Christi, state and nationally, want our local community to know they are two separate organizations. If that's what happened, that's just by coincidence. We didn't even know if the NAACP was going to have a banquet. So if it's the Their Day Foundation event here at the Ortiz Center, or the NAACP's event back here at the ABC, it's apparent that there's friction between the two groups that are running these events. Reporting in Corpus Christi, Seth Kovar, Chris 6 News.